Hello everyone, and well, what's going on here? Apparently it's a Nintendo game. That's a huge ship. Hey look, Alderaan! And it's already under attack. Looks like we're in for some trouble. Okay, enough playing stupid. It's Star Fox for the Super Nintendo. I'm officially back after a few days of having a small problem which overtook a whole week of fixing. Basically what happened was while watching a stream, my computer crashed and when I restarted, the Windows file corrupted and caused the whole thing to not let me log in or do anything on the computer. Now you have four control schemes for the game, I just showed them off real quick. I'll be using Control A because it's the one I always use and it's the default and it works best for me. Now, we've, now this is a training mode, this is just so I can get a little bit of practice and explain the game. Why is your shoot button? You know, fire blaster. X is your boost, that's what it does. A is your bomb. You can trigger it by hitting A again, and you will blow up anything on screen. Then you get your break, which is B, which I missed, which I missed on there to get through the ring. If you hit L and R, you'll do a roll. Well, you'll tell if you tap it twice, you should do a full spin. I was just getting this until you're familiar with the controls enough. Ow, I should have braked. There's boost. And then once you're ready, because this part is annoying as well, you know. You're supposed to stay in that ship and follow it, but as you can see, I'm having a little bit of problems, and they do a lot better than I do there. But here's the official game now. You have three routes. Level 1, which we're taking. Level 2 goes up, and level 3 goes the bottom route. I'll try to go through all three. No promises. Star Fox team, our last resort is a counter-attack Venom. Thank you. Things may act a little odd for the next couple days, only because I'm still fixing things, so if you hear any odd sounding glitches or anything... I'm still trying to fix things, but other than that, we're good. We're now officially in the game, we have our three wingmen, Slippy, Peppy, and Falco, and we have enemies. Basically, yeah, this is your screen, very minimal. And now we're gonna fly through rings. Well, not rings, but gates. You want to do this? Trust me, you want to. Yes, I did see you. I do try to take the enemy out, but I miss here. But it doesn't matter too much. We now have twin blasters, a more powerful variation of our current weapon. Well, of our weapons, there are three levels: regular, hyper. Well, I should know. I the regular, twin, and hyper. I can speak just right. That's one thing that didn't go wrong: is me trying to speak. You always upgrade from from the first, from single to triple. Whoops, sorry, Slippy. Oh, he was mine! Oh wait, that's not in this game. That's the 64 version. That's right. You don't get the voices complaining here. You see their little thing on the bottom and a little default sound. That's an extra bomb, by the way. Never the five bombs at a time. Real quick, in the upper left hand corner is your spare ships. You can also earn continues as well as extra lives. I'll try to earn a couple extra lives, but no promises. Bomb left is your shield. If your shield's gone, you are done. Game, set, match. You will die and lose a life. The bottom right, that blue bar is your boost slash break meter. When you hit the boost or break, that's active and is how long it'll last for. On top of that is how many bombs you're carrying. That's it. By the middle, when, some, when an enemy has something to say, he will say it there. 
Each one has a different help and a different... Oh, speaking of help, okay. They also got you for shooting at them. I know, how nice, right? Try to kill everything on screen when it appears. It does help a little bit more, and there is a reason why I say that at the end of the stage. I'll tell you why. Wait, we're still flying through Carnaria. We're always at the boss. When you see this guy and take him out, get low. Incoming enemy. Yes, he's going to try to hit you from above. Hey, is that guy from the opening? He's path one and path two's boss. Path three gets a different boss. I will play all three paths if I can. No promises. Oh, he was on the wrong side. And now he's gonna go on the left side. He's always he always alternates unless you take the others out. There you go. Third part. Shoot, 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 shoot. Okay, final part. You can roll to the dodge or well take the hit. Take hits, take hits. Come on. And when he goes up like that, boom! That's the end of the stage. Oh shit, check in. So far, so good. Okay, okay, what's next? No sweat, Fox. And now we're gonna fly off to the next planet and, well, to the map. Your score is presented by how the amount of enemies you kill. I believe your teammates also get healed. If you get 100 points and then every odd 100 after, 1, 3, 5, 7, you'll get an extra continue! You start with zero continue, so getting 100 in the first stage often helps. Android forces intend to build a base in this area. Destroy their rock crusher. We're in the asteroid belt now, which is stage two. And we get the in cockpit view, which is my favorite view in this game, to be honest. I do a lot better when I'm in it, but not always. But yeah, it's not too bad to get through this game on level one. Now, the thing about your wingman is, unlike the later games, which come back at the end of a, a mission or two, this one, if they're shot down, that's it. You're gone. No, you won't have it for the rest of the game. This can be a handicap because not only will they not help you, but their enemies might come after you. Bogey on his six, he's got an enemy on his tail. And he's being hard. Come back here so I can hit your enemy. Oh, he's received some damage. You can't kill your own wingmen, I think, but they can take a lot of damage from enemies. Well, he tests my theory on if they get healed or not at the end of the stage. It's been a while since I played this one, I don't really remember. Meanwhile, during my time off, I have officially hit one year being on YouTube. I did have something I was going to do, but it's not going to happen now, especially because I lost a few videos, so... It's what you guys make of it, basically. Sorry, I'm going to get yelled at. We'll see you in Smash later, Falco. But yeah, either way, just we're just cruising through the asteroid belt. The gold rocks can be destroyed, the silver ones can't. Very easy, not too bad. Try to collect bombs, try to take out everything. Oh, I never explained the rings. The yellow rings restore health. There are silver rings which restore a lot more health, if not full health. And then there's the blue checkpoints. Blue rings restore health and are also checkpoints. You do want to grab those. Speaking of... Thank you! We haven't seen all the power-ups yet, but I will try to show them all off. Somehow. Get lost, you fiend. Yeah, get lost. See, that's how you do it. You get right, you go right across, and then you turn, and then I'll take them out. Ow. Give me these things out of the game, because we do want to get 100% if we can. 
for the healing. There are some cheap one-shot deaths later on we'll be dealing with, but hopefully we won't run into too many. Ow. Almost at the end of the stage now, I think. Also, during my time off, I took time to play Gran Turismo, by the way. Again. I love the series, I would play him on this thing, but... Well, computer doesn't like him. What's the car? Here's our boss, Rock Crusher. See those four little diamonds? There's eight of them on each, two on each side. Take them out. So yeah, that's all I've been doing besides listening to music by Perfume and other. Great! He took out my wing. Not only does that cancel out any laser you have, but. I believe you lose a little bit of maneuverability, and the next time I pick up a weapon upgrade, is it being a weapon upgrade is now going to be a wing repair thing. So yeah, that just handicapped us hard. What do you think I do these things out? The mill goes away and he appears. In fact, this time to make my system work, now that I'm explaining. Actually, listen to perfume and trying to get a little bit of to make sure everything was recording right. And you can see it worked. And you can see my little wing stub. And I'm just gonna check in. We're gonna see how far they're damaged. Flippy's pristine. Peppy's pristine. Falco isn't. How do we do? Perfect! No, it looks like they don't heal up. And, well, we're getting the episode here, so on the next episode, we're gonna fight the Space Armada. Hope you had fun, and I'll see you on the next one.